Hello, everybody. My beautiful assistant, Amanda James, who is also a rock star photographer. Um, she loves photographing live concerts. However, this year has been a little different. She is also the queen of iPhones. Because let me tell you, we had a photo shoot today at Harvey's Lake. Beautiful family, a ton of breakdowns. And me, Amy, my typical self, always loses this. All the time, lose it, lose it, lose it. I don't know why, but like they keep getting bigger so it's harder to fit in your pocket. They just keep getting bigger. It's like you're carrying a computer, technically. So what did I do today on our shoot? Ah, oh, <laughs> like I do on many, but you know, for some reason today it was a little different. As we're loading the gear into my FJ Cruiser, the Toyota that I love so much, um, I decided to place my phone on my bumper. And what did I do? I totally spaced and forgot it was on my bumper. So we load everything in, my phone's chilling on my bumper, and we leave the lake. And we're cruising around the lake. Everything's flowing, soft cruise because deer are out at this time, everybody's eating. I mean, we're cruising mountain roads here. And all of a sudden, as we drive up on the top of the mountain, I'm like, oh my God, my phone's not plugged into my charger. Where's my phone? Where's my phone again? I lost my phone again. And this beautiful soul who is filming me now says, oh, I'll find our iPhone app. I'm like, what? I'm too old for all this. I can't keep up. And she brings up the iPhone. She starts typing in all this whatever code stuff and finds my phone. And here we think I left it out the lake, lo and behold, as we're almost back out the lake, because keep in mind, I'm back home and we're driving back and forth everywhere, going crazy, trying to look for my phone because everything is on here and I haven't backed it up in a long time. Note to self, I'm backing up tonight. Um, so we're driving and realize, okay, it's on a road somewhere. We find it. We do find it. We pull over. It was... We're on Huntsville Road, we're passing Chase Corners. All of a sudden we're up on the top, like of the mountain again, not far from where I was like, oh my God, I lost my phone. Here, I guess, the turn that we took, that was by that farm, keep in mind, otter, otter cases, I love you. Otter, I will sponsor, if you wanna sponsor me, if you wanna hook me up, we can work together because your cases are phenomenal. Keep this in mind. The otter case is the bomb, and I will always buy these cases because my phone flew off of my back bumper, Space Cadet Bezik, on one of the turns and was laying in the road. This phone was ran over so many times by the time we found it. And thank God for the bing, 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 because the two of us were running around on a mountain road, keep in mind, which isn't safe, because now the sun was set and we couldn't see. Finally, we find this phone. But look it, look it. That's all that happened, some cracks. It was ran over, I don't know how many times. What was that? Probably at least like a 40 minute time frame of us running back and forth to the lake trying to find this. And I mean, I know you could tell it was ran over because look at the cracks, but look at my cute little puppy. It still works, look it. Face ID. Oh, it still works. Oh my God. The text, it still works. My phone, everything still works. Thank you, Otter. Because if I didn't have your case, this would have been ran over, smashed to pieces. We wouldn't have found it with the Find My iPhone. Thank you, Apple. And um, lo and behold, at the end of the night, all is good and well. Because how important is this to all of us? It's like our lifeline. It's like everything is in here. All my clients, all my appointments, all my everything. However, I did delete Facebook and social media off of most of this because it's all whatever. So thank you, Apple. Thank you, Otter. And thank you to my assistant for being so freaking radical because I'm too old to learn all this shit. 